fort bhi ho gayi yesterday night we had come right we couldn't see the fort at all so now we are seeing clock tower baju mein fort view is also there this makkhan added makkhan means butter butter is added here that's the reason it's called makkhaniya lassi hmm it's very rich very rich and has lesser pista and all hmm taste is very good i highly recommend हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू अ न्यू वीडियो फ्राम लक्ष्मी कामत व्लॉग्स एंड इन दिस एपिसोड वी आर इन डे फोर ऑफ राजस्थान सीरीज वी आर ट्रैवलिंग फ्राम जोधपुर टू उदयपुर तो करेंटली वी आर हैविंग लंच इन दिस रेस्टोरेंट कॉल्ड द स्पाइस रूट वी हैड क्वाइट अ फ्रूटफुल डे टूडे वी बिगैन द डे विद उमेद भवन पैलेस एंड देन हैडेड टू मेहरांगर फोर्ट एंड देन टू जसवंत तड़ा I have made separate videos for those. I I will leave a link in the i button as well as in the description box. Our Guruji has googled somewhere that Rajasthan में दी eat gulab jamun की सब्जी. Now he wants to eat that it seems. Gulab jamun की सब्जी. Three hundred bucks. Okay, you order that. He ordered gulab jamun की सब्जी. and roti let's see how this tastes this is gulab jamun ki sabzi this is butter roti mm -hmm. gulab jamun this is ana kusan ye ye khala surj ho chu hai what is this bro This is gulab jamun. It seems. वो तेल है क्या सर? घी है. घी है. Everything is butter, butter, घी, घी. मार्केट इन दे लाइट ऑल्सो दैट वी कैन शॉप समथिंग एंड देन ट्राई मखनिया लस्सी लाल होटल मखनिया लस्सी इज द स्पेशलिटी ऑफ जोधपुर प्याज कचोरी शॉपिंग मखनिया लस्सी आई फाउंड दैट दे आर चीपर देन दैट ऑफ जयपुर सो आई वुड रेकमेंड शॉपिंग हियर इन जोधपुर मार्केट्स एज वेल वी हैड कम टू क्लॉक टावर इन द नाइट आई हैड मेड अ वीडियो फॉर दैट एज वेल आई लीव अ लिंक इन द आई बटन सो यू कैन चेक दैट आउट व्हेन वी केम इन द नाइट वी डिड नॉट सी दिस फोर्ट एट ऑल and now in the daylight it's looking gorgeous See, this is the clock tower and there is a fort view yesterday night we had come right we couldn't see the fort at all so now we are seeing clock tower baju mein fort view is also there so this is how it looks it's a good idea so guru ji insisted we come to this shri mishri lal hotel here on his google's research then i uh, will get some parcel from of kachori which we got yesterday you know from there we need that as well we will get some parcel from the shri lal hotel clock tower makhaniya lassi rabdi and special pede स्पेशल मखनिया लस्सी इज मखन एडेड मखन मीन्स बटर बटर इज एडेड हियर दैट्स द रीजन इट्स कॉल्ड मखनिया लस्सी इट्स वेरी रिच वेरी रिच एंड हैज बेसर पिस्ता एंड ऑल टेस्ट इज वेरी गुड 
I highly recommend near clock tower. This is near clock tower, Jodhpur, Makkaniya, Lassi. In this is a Mishri Lal Hotel. History. It was started in 1927. Shahi Samosa, Arora Namkeen. Yesterday we came here, right? Last night. We're going here again now. And then we began our journey to Udaipur. It was good six hours journey by road and very tiring. We left from Jodhpur around 2.30. Our driver ji, Mr. Rizwan had told us that the road to reach Udaipur, from Jodhpur to Udaipur, the road was not good. It had a landslide recently. So it asked us that we better reach Udaipur in the daylight itself. And the road from Jodhpur to Udaipur also has some areas where there is Adivasis. There are Adivasis and there is Adivasi attack on the general public. So there were some incidents of such as well. So it was the best to reach in the broad daylight. And amazing good roads all thanks to Ministry of National Highways. Mr. Nitin Gadkari ji. Amazing great roads and great view as well. People are literally hanging from this jeep. Look at the last guy who is standing <laughs> holding the top, and then there's this woman who is literally outside the jeep. Oh, And six hours later, finally, we reached Udaipur. We also had a flat tire on the way, but our driver G, Mr. Rizwan, had great driving skills. So the drive was very smooth, thanks to him. Siddhartha in Siddhartha in the service There was some confusion when we were trying to check in The hotel the receptionist said we had no bookings here But then we quickly called our Neeraj ji From Flex States Media Tours and Travels He quickly resolved this issue for us There was some issue with the back end Thanks to Neeraj G Flag States Media Tours and Travels and Travel Triangle for seamless experience. Now let's do the room tour. As soon as you enter, first thing is only washroom. They have given bathroom chappal. It's the same as previous room. Uh, first, they have given bathroom chappal. This is something different. Bathroom is good. Oh, they have a dedicated wash basin and a big mirror. 
they have a curtain there is a shower and commode and then there is a table chair kettle for two to three kettles here or oh, ac there is a table that uh, bed, bed this is tv which we will never on <laughs> And there's a very nice cozy bed, I think. Oh yeah, pink pink bed. Then there is a chair. Oh, there's so much space though. What to do? Some more people can sleep here. Hey! Let's see what is the view in the balcony. Oh, it's a roadside view. This is the roadside view. Yeah, so the entire day we spent in travel. So a uh, morning around nine o'clock we started, I think. Then we went to two three places in uh, Jodhpur. Jodhpur is um, the cultural capital of Rajasthan. So the high court of Rajasthan is in Jodhpur. We went to Mehrangarh Fort, and then we could see those blue houses. And then uh, we went to Jaswantara. Umed Bhavan, uh, yeah, the journey six hours from Jodhpur to Udaipur, and our driver Ji was telling all throughout the way. Road from Jodhpur to Udaipur, right? It's very scary, it seems. So there is our driver was constantly telling that there is there are Adivasi people around, and uh, or uh, some other Lutera people thieves. Uh, bandits basically they will come and throw eggs stones rocks on your car and make you stop the car then they'll come and loot you this is what is the you know it's a little scary you should cross that road in broad daylight this is what he was saying so he was telling that we have to leave that place by 2 2:30 uh, max then we started at 2:30 exact and then, uh, yeah, we uh, crossed all of that and reached Udaipur by 7.30. So, it was all broad daylight only. So make sure you are leaving from Jodhpur to Udaipur in broad daylight, not in the evenings. Yeah, the time is almost 8 o'clock. We'll call it a day. I don't think we'll go outside after this. Uh, yesterday and today, both the days were spent mostly in travel. From Jaipur to Jodhpur, we travelled yesterday. 6 hours and today from Jodhpur to Udaipur another 6 hours my god too much and end this vlog here I hope you are enjoying our Jodhpur our Rajasthan series if yes please hit that like button and subscribe and support your girl Lakshmi Khamat and I will see you in next video because I okay the way I am talking it's obvious I have no energy left uh, my back is broken and I don't feel my legs. So if you're coming to Rajasthan while ending the vlog, I'm also still talking, okay? One uh, important thing I wanted to mention is when you're coming to Rajasthan, be prepared to walk, uh, carry comfortable shoes, your stylish sandals. I carried some stylish sandals which I didn't even open it because my legs are not listening to wear them. My legs, my body is rejecting those sandals just looking at them. Carry comfortable shoes. Uh, tomorrow is Udaipur city tour. City palace, Udaipur and everything around. Some two, three temples. Karni Mata temple. I want to visit a Jain Mandir also here tomorrow. Let's see if we can do all of that. Comment and tell me your favorite part of the video. And I will pin the first comment. See you in the next video. Till then, take care and bye. Jai Shri Krishna. Ram Ram.